Hello YouTube, and uh, this is my uh, part two video to the uh, Terminator 3D printed one-to-one -one scale bust. So I got it yesterday, it's been done, it's been painted. Uh, I'm very happy with this. I'd just like to thank my friend John for doing this, he does such an amazing job. Uh, I'm just going to go a bit of a close up on the the eyes now and the face. Uh, this was 3D printed. It's very light. And uh, well, like, you either pay like nearly 900 quid for the metal one or get yourself the uh, one 3D printed. So I went for the 3D printed one. Uh, apparently, uh, he had to do a lot of sanding down and and putting it together but it did fit quite well together as you can see this is like the side of the terminator head so i'm i'm very happy with this how this has turned out it looks great on display sometimes i look at it it's look like it looks like it's actually smiling at you you know uh but really i'm absolutely adore this uh i was gonna buy a proper uh proper one you know like but they just the the money the cost so i went for the 3d printed uh i love the detail of this i'm very happy i'm just gonna turn it round now and uh yeah it, it's amazing uh so i got this off etsy and uh some guy in germany sent it it came in parts uh i love what he's done with the teeth which i think look amazing uh, but when this is displayed next to the arm and the other Terminator heads, uh, I'm very happy with it. There's the uh, the, the T2 uh, logo. So this is the one from Terminator 2. Uh, just going around now. But it's, uh, yeah, I'm, it's so light. I mean, it, it, look, you can just, you don't even struggle lifting it up, you know. So it is one-to-one -one scale. I did check. I because a friend of mine said he's sure it's one to one it is and uh, I checked on the site I got it from and I've confirmed it is one to one scale I suppose when you put flesh and air on it it looks a lot bigger I am looking at getting another Terminator bus but uh, with the sort of Arnie wearing the glasses and you know like the endoskeleton like all, all the skin rips off here and that and he's got the sunglasses on that's what I'm looking at but I'm really impressed with this. He's done a beautiful job. Uh, the thing is with 3D printing stuff, you get a lot of lines on the stuff. You know, there's lots of lines and that, which can be a bit annoying, I suppose. But it depend, that depends on the quality of the printer, you know. But uh, yeah, so this is my review of my T2 3D printed head. Uh, let me know your thoughts on this, guys. I'll just go over to the other one here. That's obviously factory made. And uh, that's it. So what I'm going to do now is... Just got that spoiled by an advert in the background. Another blooper. Uh, so, yeah, once it's displayed, I will put some pictures up after this video. Uh, where it's on display and uh, let me know your thoughts right then guys uh, I will see you on the next video and uh, please enjoy this and uh, give me a like and a subscribe and a share and uh, I will see you on the next video